what exactly is Henry? Henry is a technology that we've created that allows you to take your bubble apps, add some native functionality and ship it into the Apple App Store and Google Play Store. But hold on, what does that mean exactly? So in essence, Henry is a combination of a bubble plugin plus a very specific thunkable template that together gives you a hybrid app that renders your bubble app as a website, but allows you to access some of Thunkable's native features and then use Thunkable to ship it in the App Store and Google Play Store. Let's have a look at it in practice. So let's say I created a mobile website on Bubble, like this one here, and I want to ship it in the Apple App Store or Google Play Store. I could go to Thunkable and on one screen, add a web viewer component. That's this thing right here, which allows me to render web pages. So it's basically just a browser. Add the URL of my app here, and I'd be good to go. And then I could use the Thunkable publishing mechanism to ship this in the Apple App Store or Google Play Store. But hold on, as said, this is just a browser. But if you wanted to access more native functionalities, for example, like showing alerts, making in-app purchases, sending push messages, and so on, we couldn't do that because we're just still rendering a website in a browser that's packaged in an app. That's why we've built Henry. So let's go back. As said, Henry is a combination of a Bubble plugin and a Thunkable template. Let's start with the plugin part first. In our app, we have installed a plugin called Henry. And we see Henry comes with a lot of elements, it comes with a lot of events, and it comes with a lot of actions. And these actions speak with our Thunkable template because in our specific Thunkable template, we have added a lot of intelligence behind the scenes that allows us to interact with our Bubble app. So we see there's a lot of functionality here. It doesn't look like much now, but if, for example, we open one of these blocks and expand it, we see there's actually a lot of intelligence going on behind the scenes. This allows us to interact with our Bubble plugin that we've just installed. But then we can just install it on our phone because now we have an app. And I could, for example, show native alerts, or we could make the phone vibrate, which you can see in the video. We can use the share functionality. I can get things like the current location or infos about the device that is currently being used. I can store local variables. I can play audio. I can record video. I can even influence the color of my status bar. I can also hide the contents of my status bar if I wanted to do that and so on. If you want to use it, first, of course, build your Bubble app, get the Henry plugin from the Bubble marketplace, adjust your workflows. For example, here, simple example, if I wanted to use the alert, just have a simple workflow where I use a predefined action that's provided by the plugin, copy the Thunkable template, add the URL of your app here, and you're good to go. Afterwards, you can use Thunkable's extended documentation guiding you through creating Apple and Google developer accounts and shipping your apps to the actual stores. We hope you love this product as much as we do. We're very excited and thanks for being here. Cheers.